All right, I wanted to do a quick update for Ripple XRP. So back in April, we did a very nice five-wave impulse. And as early wave states, after five waves, there is a requisite correction. Now, just using a horizontal line, I want to see how long it took to do an impulse wave. So it represented about this much in time, maybe a month and a half. Now, to measure the correction, it took about four times as long about 4x and this is what I'm consistently referring to as hurry up and wait. The impulse waves are done without wasting any time. There is no delay, no dragging of feet, but when it comes to the correction, the first ABC, and this first ABC is often confused as the bottom. And yet it's going to go sideways and sideways. And it's easy to forget and be lulled into thinking something like this or bottom here might be the bottom of the correction. It's always going to be long. Now I think every coin, even Bitcoin, Back in the 2013-14 correction, there was about a 14-15 month bear market. And it did something similar to maybe like looking like this. It went side, it went declined sideways for a very long time in a flat line. And then it rose. Now the liquidity value of Bitcoin at that time was very low. The liquidity value of Ripple at this time was pretty low. As the market size market cap increases, the liquidity of the value of the coin will increase. So the question here is how long will Ripple take in the correction? If increase in market cap, increase in liquidity, increase in the number of holders and traders for Ripple increases, to me, in many ways, the coin maturity increases as well. And the maturity is measured, of course, not in behavior. However, maturity of the coin is measured in largely on its liquidity. How high or how lacking that liquidity might be. Therefore, it took approximately in the second round, almost no time. Almost no time for the impulse waves to be put in. In time, it was equivalent to this. Then the correction started. And this correction is so far about equal to the time it has taken to put in the impulse prior impulse waves. I believe this correction could extend longer. But it may not be as long in proportion as here. Because the liquidity and the popularity and the tradability and the exchange presence in the number of exchanges has increased dramatically. So instead of going all the way out here in about the same proportion as it did in the first one, I think the length of time of the wait is the hurry up and the wait phase could be a bit truncated because of that maturity gain. 
a while on the proportional. It could come all the way out to maybe June, July before it starts rising. I believe that would be truncated by the higher degree and level of maturity, higher level of liquidity for a ripple. And therefore, it could be something to this time effect of one, two, three times as long. And if that's the case, I think from a trending perspective, an awareness perspective, it could be healthy. I still do this as if there could be one more lower low. Yes. If you think the correction is done right here, I don't think so. Many made that mistake ABC, even thinking right here it was done. We're in a very similar situation. I don't think the correction will be done here. I think it's going to go sideways, maybe even with one more lower low. But it may not be as long. It may have matured enough in liquidity so that what could have been longer is truncated. I hope you find that helpful. I wanted to share that with you. One has to be careful to not think the correction is over so quickly. You need to consider still the hurry up and the weight syndrome of the altcoins. Here's the hurry up and we have to go through probably a bit more lengthy correction more sideways so let's see how it goes now the time frame that i put in here going from february march april may middle of may could be it it could expand to that i am using now the time frame to this to as a reference as a guide and aid it could turn around much earlier than that if the maturity is a lot higher than we suspect it to be. Thank you and have a good night.